a historic city which is thriving in this modern age. With buildings on par with world famous cities, it's no wonder why Daniel Lieberskind credited its heritage and architecture. Warmly welcomed in a sold out lecture theatre, Daniel inspired the future generation. With projects ranging from the One World Trade Centre to Berlin's Jewish Museum, his extensive resume is all down to the idea of memory. We have today produced many cities that I would call Alzheimer's cities. Cities where you can't remember who you are and, what you, and what it's, where you're going. Cities that don't have any support for true understanding of direction in life, not just in space. So yes, I think a very important memory and, and history therefore. A refugee himself after leaving Poland in 1957, Daniel held the lecture in aid of the Red Cross. But why choose Liverpool as the venue? So these are cities that have great uh, heritage, not just in terms of the obvious incredible buildings in the 19th century, 20th century, like the cathedral, like the school, but have a lot to do with the growth of consciousness about what urbanism, what cities really are. And in that sense, of course, it's one of these iconic cities in the world. The texture of Liverpool, its history, its people, the working people of Liverpool. So these are cities that have great uh, heritage. Eleanor Davis, JMU Journalism.